Okay, so part two. Uh, this is what I need to do is obviously I'm going to have to create because the sort change will have to be recreated every time the window changes size. Right now, um, uh, plus I'm not even displaying anything. So what I need is basically like along with the surface because that's this is tied to the window. Uh, what I need is like a boolean. It's like we need rebuild. It starts off with true, of course. So something along the lines of if um you know put it at the end. So when Make sure that it this uh, even fires. Uh, resize, yes. I probably also want to have this fire off like right at the start as well. Hmm. Or not. Figure that out later. Um, so then in here we'd reset, well, we set, um, we'd rebuild. Then at some later point, uh, we determine like uh, if we were going to if so we may not do Vulcan render every loop. It may just be like we're doing a whole bunch of uh, other information and that we don't have an image available for Vulcan rendering, so we skip over and come back through. Um, like that. But if we do go inside, then we'd have to like uh, rebuild swap chains. And then we'd have to do rendering. this in like that. Hmm. Do we need to do surface stuff? I don't quite think we need that. I'll assume I'll assume that the surface is whatever. There, so if so this would also be true by default. Yeah. Then we'd launch into requiring into building everything we need. So um, VK window dot need rebuild equals false at the end. If do we? Hmm. 
Hmm. That's actually true. If we don't have dot uh, swap chain, if we don't have a swap chain yet, then that means we don't have a uh, surface. Either, which means we'll have to we'll have to figure them out here at this point. Which means we'd get these guys up here instead as part of the loop. Okay, window dot format. Presentation mode. Once we have them, Then we go into the new swap chain stuff. So VK um, swap chain. Okay, try new swap chain. We want to grab the information of the width and height from the window. Or rather, no, no, no. We can grab that information once we're inside. So we do, we'll call into a sub function that'll create it. Then if uh, because a new swap chain will over will overwrite over a new swap chain will replace the old swap chain, but the old swap chain may still be in use for a couple of frames. So I need to uh, whatever. I need to delete this old swap chain though myself. If pk window dot swap chain not equal um, null handle. Destroy it. Uh, okay, window dot swap chain. Do that, and then okay, window swap chain equals new swap chain. Swap chain, which is this stuff right about here. We do need, do we? We need these guys, right? Physical surface capabilities. What for temp? What did I do? Oh, yeah, that was me trying to figure out why it uh, didn't work. 
because I didn't have the device extension. Create new swap chain, which will be this. It'll be uh, VK window dot format dot format. VK window dot format. The extent. No, yeah. Hmm. Oh, yeah. And then we can have dot old. Was it dot um, dot old swap chain equals window dot swap chain. Mm hmm. Hmm. Actually, this is kind of a thing. Uh, if I'm going to be doing destruction, I should probably wait. I mean, not for this. I think destroying a swap chain is fine in this case. But if I wanted to delay destroy other things, I need like a function that can, uh, well, delay a couple of the destruction of certain items for a couple of uh, frames or ticks. Hmm. Now, we'll, a bit later, uh, just a tiny bit later. One thing I do need uh, is I will want will be to I do want the surface capabilities, don't I? Actually, so I can get the uh, yeah. that and surface Surface capabilities dot um, current extent max image extent. We'll just do that every time. It's always the max image extent. I think. Okay. Tree size, whoop, does that. Comes back here. Uh, surface capabilities, max image extent is now the new size. Okay. But it goes will just be really fast because it's super fast. Hmm. 
And I'm not actually using the swap chains yet. So it doesn't matter if I destroy them right away. Okay, but let's use... Hmm. Yeah, yeah, okay. I could probably do it that way. Just really, okay. Great. Get that in, which gives me what I need for that. Present mode, and then we get this swap chain right back out. Almost. Because we also want the AVK image extent. The AVK uh, swap chain. Chronos. Got that, that. Present mode. Uh, one last thing. Swap chain. Like that. surface from that we get the surface capabilities we're going to want to if turn res otherwise oh yeah chain size If it's less than that, then chain size is going to become this instead. It's the minimum. If um, chain size is greater than
Wait, there was a max image count of zero. Let me have a look at uh, what this says. Max image count. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Surface capabilities too. Previous. Max image count is the maximum number of images. Will be either zero or greater than or equal to. Value of zero means there is no limit. But there may be limits related to total memory. Okay. So currently chain size is at least minimum image count. So if chain, uh, sorry, if surface capabilities max uh, image count is greater than zero and chain size is greater than surface Max image count and chain size equals capabilities. Okay, I just got to down capabilities. I don't want to say surface capabilities every time. Max image count. All right. Pre-transform right now. Let's do pre-transform. Okay, we'll just da -da -da, surface. We'll fix that in a moment. Old swap chain. I mean, if it's passed as null handle, then null handle will be passed through and it'll still be safe. Okay, surface transform extent. According to this, if capabilities dot current width equals three to max, because if I go back to the spec and uh, if the is the current width and height of the surface or a special value of Max U with 32 indicating the surface size will be determined by the extent of a swap chain targeting the surface. So uh, basically, there's no. Wait. Minimum, smallest valid swap chain. Width and height of the extent will be less than or equal to the corresponding width and height of the current extent, unless current extent has a special value described above. Okay. You want thirty two max?
extent, m extent. Um, In which case that becomes extent uh, present mode. Okay, let's see how this comes out. Do, 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 new swap chain as equals. Uh, I'm just going to say three right now. And then we'll get the uh, size of the window here. that these are ints okay Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, I need to swap chains are fine, but now I need to, what's this? I'll return, really, return res. Oh, and surface transform. I'm, I'm missing that. Um, um, flags.
Otherwise, we'll just use whatever the current one is. And pre-transform is what goes in here. Really? Okay. How does it get out without returning something? Oh, yes. Turn that. Probably put an unlikely on that. Because it only happens very rarely. Or, hmm. Hmm. We'll see. No, we'll just that. This probably would be a little bit easier if the wind, if the windows are a bit more self-contained. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, we have the swap chain. We need to get the images out of it. That's right. Or the image views anyways. Mm, will it be part of this? Not really. And that's always to kind of create like a sub, uh, make create a class instead of doing this kind of open system instead. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that makes some sense. So I can also keep track of um, the presentation because I'd also have to acquire images from this, which also means I need like the um, By default, starts at nothing because there's no images, and then we'll start going through and acquiring these guys. Yeah, yeah, that makes a bit more sense. Hmm. Hmm. 
Okay, let's just get let's just get the images. Forget about acquiring the images, just get the image views. Okay. This format will come from the surface format. Hmm. Okay, I can grab one thirty two to two. Oh, in order to do that, I also need the images themselves, don't I? Yeah, okay. That we need. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is quite the mess, actually. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to kind of split this up. This is just some kind of monstrosity. It's a bit of uh... we won't do that. We'll have uh, so BK result swap. Format and images, they'll be in those will be internal. So we just need the device. Here now we have device. We're going to go with uh, swap chain equals swap chain. Image count equals image count. Or pointer. Okay, image array of size, whatever, whatever we need.
Okay, now we now have the images. So now we can say views dot resize. Actually, it also means okay views dot clear views dot resize. Oh no, no, we could just resize. We can just overwrite. Oh yeah. Um, oh, we're going to, have to delete the image views, aren't we? Hmm. Okay, before we go into this, we're going to have to go through the iterator views and we'll have to delete them. If like that, then we resize. We just clear and then views dot uh, reserve um, up to image count. Flags, no image. Image will be set in a moment. View type. Two D. Format or format or um, dot format. Components equals DK. So it's all um, identity. What's identity? Is it like um, what I think it is? Don't know. We'll just do swizzle our G B A Sub resource range. Equals this, which is a sub thing of its own. We say, um, this is 
the tie um, DK image aspect color. Zero. There's one level. And one layer. We then go to four. Image equals images. Just jump out. Otherwise, if we didn't fail, then we're going to say use dot new view. Oops, where did I go? Here. Whole bunch of errors. Starting with that. Return res. I'll just do this quickly. P data swap chain.
Hmm. Okay. Let's get some more serious about this then. That salt chain thing. This. going to have can't actually do these by defaults for sure at all. I need to be able to destroy the uh, objects. Okay. Whatever. VK results. I already kind of have that as to create views. Okay. VK. Basically, be these, right? This function. Let's split this up a little bit and to swap chain. Let's get into a separate file as well. Copyright, paste it in. This will be like photographics.
that'll be private eventually because that'll be part of the create function as well. Because create function is basically going to handle everything we need. I'm pretty sure. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, put this slap it in there. We already did. Got that. So going back to this, it'll be like include. It should still be there. It says swap chain. Yes, that's not quite right. That is though. Uh, there, this is an empty function for now. Really? Oh, no, except. Not quite. No, not that. Oh, I'm not even compiling the freaking file, am I? That'll explain it. Uh, we want to be able to, okay, we move this down. We want the destroy function. And this is local as well. So we don't need this anymore. So we're local.
new swap chain, new swap chain create, then destroy the old one. And then swap chain equals new swap chain. Where it just copies all these guys. Also at the end of create actually. That equals that. And then we also wanna So the idea for this thing is that we really just don't want to, if BK error something I'll just save this for now. So that we can just have different swap chain devices and we just keep swapping through them instead. that then we're going to destroy ourselves and then return there's no point in destroying myself here because I don't actually have anything yet created but after this point mm -hmm. All right, now I need to be able to, okay, this can be private. Let's not use externally, it's used internally. What I do need though is the ability to acquire, acquire images, acquire next image. All right, acquiring images. Image device swap chain timeout some four fence image index.
<clears throat> okay. 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 destroy Our next image VK device yes the stuff okay Turn that instead. Otherwise, because I don't want to. Hmm. There's going to be a, a period of time in which current index, when I acquire an image, current index will be set to a none that value. And then when I when I return the presentation info, presumably to be submitted by some external part of an external thing, then it'll be reset to this. So if this is still this value, if this if this is not this value, if this is like an actual index, then that means I haven't presented it yet. So don't try yet. Uh, to acquire another one. Uh, there's no timeout. We're always going to be returning. We're going to be ready semaphore this will be never going to do that and i'll be like in index Otherwise, current index was already still E132 max. No. Yes, yeah, so they only get in here if it is E132 max. So, yeah, that. And then we're going to have.
I don't want, I, I could try to present from internally, but uh, that's, uh, if I want to try to present multiple images to like multiple windows at once, I need to have the data printed back out to something instead. Yeah, BK swap. And then If, um, no, it's not a member yet. Really? Oh, yes, you do. Okay, now to actually see if what I think is going to happen is actually happening. So Check new swap chain. New swap chain has current index, presentation mode of garbage, format is nothing, needs to be rebuilt. Wonderful. And the views are empty. New swap chain. There's a swap chain. There's no views. That's not good. That's not right at all. Whoops, diddly doodly. Not quite working as expected. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Success. Okay, wonderful. We go inside of here. We don't need to do this anymore. We'll get that rid of that in a second. Image count becomes three. Are now three images. Yes. Okay, one, two, three. There are now three views. Ah, yes, of course, that would make a lot of sense. If it failed to create, then we do this. And we don't need to do it here. Actually, we don't even need to do this here. As it would happen later anyways. Because then it would get kicked back out to here, who would then destroy the device and all the images anyways.
This presentation mode is something else. Like, wow. Immediate. Swap chain, the presentation mode is that. Okay. New swap chain presentation. I give it, but I don't actually set it. Mm -hmm. Do I need it? Technically, yeah. Yeah. Let us turn these into members and needs rebuild. Service format and present mode. Swap chain. Put the Vulcan stuff up there. Current index and views. Uh, acquired index and views. Okay, so what we got we got do 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 Present mode, old swap chain equals swap, old swap chain. No, no, no. We'll just kind of leave it out for the moment. Uh, M format, M surface format, dot format. Engine, we've got a couple of
Okay, we've got a couple of little things. Um, Cannot spell. Okay. Mode. Swap chain is these are public things. Well, by default, actually, it should be like a false because there's nothing. to rebuild because there's no swap chain or anything. These are all empty objects by default. Okay, we can use these to determine whether or not this is even active. Okay, let's get a couple of these functions into play, destroy, acquire next image, present data. Okay.
H R. Let's just grab and copy paste these lads around, just like that. And then we need a rebuild if we're changing if we change if we're changing the surface format for whatever reason then we need a request rebuild right away. It'll basically be the same thing over here. Probably, do we want the same thing for VK extent? <laughs> yeah. So we don't have to do width and height. We would have to do it still. But we can store it in the old swap chain and then give it to the new guy. No. No, that doesn't make sense. Actually, no, it does. Maybe no, no, no VK extent yet. Don't need it yet. Don't touch it. Uh, back to engine. Um, oh, the bools, the booleans. Yes. Um, so it'd be up at the top. Yes, if not swap chain, then we can do this stuff. Swap chain dot surface format equals that. And then we can um, just have a single um, okay, swap chain KHR. Hmm. No, like like the bool one, it'll be like operator that we can just
There we go. And then we can just return, just swap chain like that, just like that. No viable conversion from that to that. Yes, there is. Need rebuild. No, he's just, he knows he's been rebuilt. Really? Swap chain is null. And there we go. So he fires off in the first round. We resize him. And he's a new size. Just moved around, nothing. Okay. Pretty okay with that. Okay, now that we have this, I need to present what is currently an empty image to the front. Actually, I'm wondering if I just don't destroy VK window data like that, is it just, does, does it not care? Is the, are the validation layers not caring? Or do I even have validation? Oh, I don't even have validation. I have the debug callback, but I probably don't actually have like uh, the validation layers themselves. That's probably why I'm not getting any real good feedback out. Hmm. Um, environment. Layers go to the instance, and I don't have any layers whatsoever right now, do I? Let's go. Oh, okay. It looks like a uh, clangy crashed. That's probably why none of this is working. There we go. Go to declaration. Um. Okay. Oh, it's a string. It's a string, you idiot.
I guess not. Oh, yes, it did. It just took a long ass time. To load the, there we go. There's the validation layers and stuff. And then we leave, and then it has, yes. This layer just took forever to load. Is it like just mass for something? No, just put that one in. Wow, yeah, okay, uh, yeah. Yes, I understand why it takes forever to load then. 380 megabytes worth of validation stuff. Jeez. They went all out on that one. Is there like another VK? VK something. Wow, that is just massive. Jeez. It must have like everything in it. Hmm. Well, I guess that's good for validation. Such as whatever this swap chain create info nonsense is going on about. And the fact that some of these things is not are not being properly destroyed. Uh, sorry, not it's a swap chain. Okay. I'll look at this later. It was nearly an hour 40. So I got validation and I got sub windowing stuff, swap chaining and stuff. Can I maybe do throw some, uh, throw something up? Onto the window rendering. Okay. Hmm. Equals swap chain dot acquire next image. Device. And a semaphore, which I don't even have quite yet. Um. OK. 
Okay. Okay. If we're not ready, if we can't acquire an image to start rendering to, then there's no point in actually doing anything here. Um, for rendering anyways, compute stuff may still happen, but that can be in between this and this. Or you can go before the rendering part. If uh, these guys, if it's suboptimal in that, then I won't even bother rendering. I mean, I could. But I'd rather uh, come back around, get the new swap chain, then go through with the rest of the rendering. Catastrophic error. Um, then we just like <laughs> exit the program somehow. Hmm. So then here we'd have like a. Program shutdown. Program. Yeah, program shutdown, whatever. We'll call, call it that. We don't need this really anymore, nor do we need to start one. Actually, no, we'll keep it there anyways. Program shutdown. Or rather, and shut down shortcut and then we'll have one Uh, I need to create this uh, semaphore though. 
Let's just get this a little bit up here. What's in SM4 Create? Nothing. Nothing at all. Well, there's a flag, but... Uh, I don't think I want to have anything on it quite yet. So let's say we do all this. Go to swap chain, going into the rendering, we do probably stuff. And then we'd have to present it, wouldn't we? So all that presentation. Need a bunch of stuff. First of all, we need uh, active presentations. We need swap chains. Okay. No, no, no. We'll just DK present info Kronos. Nothing to wait on. There's the swap chain account. I'm pretty sure. Let's get a double check on that. Presentation. <clears throat> P swap chains. And then the image indices on those swap chains. Ah, uh, sorry, no. dot p image indices equals that dot p results. That is, I don't remember seeing that. Uh, piece results is a pointer to an array of typed elements of sort chain count entries. Hmm. Interesting. Ah. <sighs> So then what's the, this return? If I can get individual 
VK results for each presentation request. And this one is Hmm. Okay. We need Sorry, why is there p swap chains equals this? Why is it? There we go. Uh, I need to grab Q for this as well, actually. Oh, um, Acquiring Q information. Uh, we'll get that in a second.
I'm assuming that this will be functionalized later. Then it will be like return res. Hmm. Okay, I'll just assume, I'll just hope for the moment that Uh, Q families dot Q zero, right? Because it's uh, environment is, is, is it a pointer? No, it's not. Expecting failures across the board. Go crazy. Validation errors everywhere. After the validation layers load. Yeah, okay, that's cute. <clears throat> but it's something. I have something that's trying to spit it out onto the screen, which is good. Ah, yes, the semaphores for this. Wait, semaphore. Ah, yes, 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 yes. It needs to wait for the semaphore at least. I don't wait for any semaphores yet. Equals one. Uh, wait, P. Wait, semaphores. That's what image required. Is there any way for me to like put a fence on this? No. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Q present. What's this fence for? Acquiring next image. No. Okay, for the moment, just, just, just to say. Uh, 10 milliseconds. Do thread include chrono. Using chrono literals. Yes. Are you sure about that? Um, <laughs> do do do. CVV reference, not quite compiler support, but um, Row no literals. User defined literals. Not really what I'm looking for. Here we go. Using namespace that. 
Did I not do that? Using namespace. Ah, it's the namespace. Okay. We'll just do like a couple frames. One frame. Uh, it's the creation thing. And then what we got? We got uh, image past pres present must be in layout. Image present. It's not. Okay, that makes sense. And then I imagine this is the exact same thing again. And again and again and again. Okay. But I am presenting an image. This is obviously corrupted. Well, not corrupted, but this is a pre... This was... The memory that's being used for the swap chain is obviously something that was previously used for something on the desktop. So there's part of the IDE there and some other stuff. And a bunch of garbage data. But that's progress. I'll freaking well take it. I'm not going to commit this because I'm not really, re I'll, I'll stage it, but I'm not going to commit it. It's not really there yet, but I'm kind of out of time. So I'll, that's it for now, I guess. Cheers.